Hey everyone, I'm Marissa and today on Yochi Resource we're going to learn a Qigong exercise called Drawing Down the Heavens. This is one of the most fundamental Qigong flows that you can learn. Drawing Down the Heavens is typically used as a purging and clearing flow in Qigong, but it's also wonderful to do at night to promote a sound sleep because it balances the triple warmer meridian and the endocrine system and it brings our energy down. So, this is also a great trick to use with your kids before bedtime and have them do drawing down the heavens so that they can calm down and go to bed. Now, drawing down the heavens, in my opinion, is one of the most important flows for a beginner to learn. So today we're going to look at three different versions of drawing down the heavens and really get to know the energetic movement that is involved in this flow. So stand up, find your spot, and let's learn drawing down the heavens. This first version of drawing down the heavens is for balancing and grounding. So this is a great one to do if you're overthinking, if you have headache, if you have insomnia, if there's just too much energy up in the head and you want to balance that and bring it down. So this is a great basic version to use with your kids before bed or if they've had a little shake up to get them to calm down too. All right, so let's begin. The feet are shoulder width apart and come into a nice Wuji posture. So sink the tailbone down slightly. Tuck the chin in slightly and feel that nice length in the spine. Relax the hips and feel your feet balanced and firmly planted on the earth. Then bring your attention into your hands. You can rotate the palms to face behind you slightly so that this open space under the armpits and just relax the shoulders. Relax the chest and sink your breath into your lower abdomen. And extend open the fingers. So back to the hands here. We extend the fingers open without tensing the fingers. We call this relax open the joints of the hands. This helps us to sense feel the chi so that your hands are like suction cups or magnets. You can draw energy from the earth into your hands and up through your feet. So just take a moment here to connect to that feeling. And then on an inhale, we begin. So inhale, the hands float out to the sides, shoulders relax, hands face up to the sky, and then bend the elbows and the palms just wash down the front of the body. Again, inhale. Rotate the wrists, palms face the sky, and exhale down. So one common mistake is to tense up and to really reach and bring the shoulders up and become tense. This is what we want to avoid. We want to keep the shoulders nice and relaxed, the elbows bent, so that it's just so easy and effortless to flow through this movement. Now be open and receptive. Qigong is all about connecting to nature, to the energy around us. So open, inhale, and take in all that life has to offer and allow that energy to wash down the body, balancing your energy. This exercise can be done three times, six times, nine times, 12, any multiple of three, you could do it 36 times. You just keep doing it until you feel like your energy field is balanced and you're ready to finish. Then bring your hands over your lower abdomen where we store all that good chi and smile. And it's that simple. So that was drawing down the heavens for balancing and grounding. The second version of drawing down the heavens energetically is for purging, clearing, and cleansing the body. So we're going to add a visualization to the movement. So let's begin. Come back into your Wuji posture. Knees are bent, relax the hips, 
tuck the chin in and sink the breath into the lower abdomen. Relax, open the fingers and imagine this beautiful golden light all around you, just surrounding you. You can spiral the hands and gently rock back and forth. This is nice to help to start to stir up some chi, connect to the earth, and then draw that earth chi into your hands up through your feet, and inhale, the hands rise up, rotate the wrists, gather heavenly chi, and then imagine that chi washing like a waterfall down the front of the body, down the front channel. Let's do that again. Inhale. Gather heavenly chi and let that energy wash any dirt, any negativity, impurities, or toxins down the body. This is like a chi shower. Just wash it down all the way the front into the earth recycling into Mother Earth. This time inhale, gather energy, and bring your mind to the back of the body. Wash that golden light down the back of the body. Cleansing the back channel now. Inhale, relax the shoulders, drawing the mind down the back of the head, down the neck, the back of the body, down the back of the legs, all the way into the earth. Letting go of anything you don't need, this cleansing chi shower out through the bottom of the feet. Good. This time, the central channel. So draw energy into the crown of the head, that byway point, and then wash that energy down the center line of your body, right through the central channel into the earth. Using the mind to guide the chi and the breath to direct the flow of chi down, down, down. Then bring your hands over your lower abdomen. Again, store the energy. Ah, I feel so relaxed after doing that, of course. So that was the drawing down the heavens for purging and cleansing. And you can do three in the front, three in the back, and then three down the central channel. It's just so amazing how it immediately changes the energy so quickly, very powerful. Now we're going to learn the third version of drawing down the heavens, which is called drawing in the heavens. And the reason that we changed the name to drawing in the heavens is because we're going to change the energetic flow or the energetic outcome. And we're going to do this by changing the breathing pattern. So the movement is the same. Drop your hands down to the sides into the Wuji posture. Take a breath out. Take a breath in. And this time on the exhale, the arms float out. Inhale, draw energy in. Fill up your lower abdomen. Sink as you exhale, hands float up. And then inhale, gather heavenly chi and draw that chi into your lower abdomen. Keep flowing through it. Let's do three more. Just relax the shoulders, inhale. Fill up your Dantian. The lower Dantian is the reservoir of Chi. Exhale into the earth. Rotate the wrists and gather heavenly Chi. Collect that Chi into your lower abdomen. Take some nice deep breaths into your belly. Store the Chi. So that is drawing in the heavens. It's, it's a very energizing version because we are exhaling and then inhaling, bringing that energy and storing it in our center. So for drawing in the heavens, this is a great one to do uh, in the afternoon if you feel a little bit tired. 
uh, in the morning, but probably don't do that at night before bed unless you're going to go out and party all night long because it does invigorate the body. Great. So that was the three versions of drawing down the heavens. You can check out more Yochi resource videos at yochi.com. If you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, I hope to see you there and on Facebook at Yochi Yoga Qigong. So thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.